Now this is a proportion problem. Now we have we have to use the cross product property to solve this one for x for the missing variable. I need you to recall that one half over here, one half is equal to two fourths. But what the cross products are equal to each other. So one times four is equal to two times two. We could use the cross product property over here to solve the equation for p. So I'm going to have 6 times p is equal to negative 7 times 42. Notice I keep it in a factored form because I may have to pull it apart. I know that 42 is 6 times 7, so I'll go ahead and write it out. I see that 6p is being multiplied. If I want to get p by itself, I have to divide both sides by 6. So that's what I do here. Divide both sides by 6. And it tells me that P is equal to a negative 49. 